this news got, I think, buried uh, slightly since the day after the Twitch data leak happened. And so everybody was uh, uh, like paying more attention to that. So I wanted to share this. As you can see from the headline, the PS3 and Vita stores are removing credit and debit card and payment PayPal payment options. Uh, this story coming from VGC, VideoGamesChronicle.com. They do pretty good stuff. They were the original uh, ones to break the Twitch leak story. And they posted this a day before. Um, but uh, I didn't hear any news about it, so I felt like uh, sharing this with you guys. <clears throat> Stop ending reads. Customers will need to top up their PlayStation Store wallets to make purchases. Basically, store money in the PlayStation wallets if you pl uh, plan on buying anything from the PlayStation stores. Uh, specifically from uh, PlayStation 3, PlayStation Vita. But the uh, story goes a little more in depth and I'll tell you more. So, Sony Interactive Entertainment has announced plans to limit the number of ways customers can pay for content on PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita consoles. Beginning on October 27th, customers will no longer be able to use a credit or debit card or PayPal to buy digital content to top up their PlayStation Store wallet directly from their PS3 or Vita. Instead, to continue purchasing content from the respective PlayStation stores, users will need to use a desktop computer, mobile device, PS4, or PS5. From October 27th, players will still be able to buy DLC from in-game stores, but will need to do so using wallet funds. So basically what that means is you're still going to be able to buy stuff if you have money in the wallets in the PlayStation stores. Um, but after October 20, uh, 27th, that means, which is, let's see, today is the 7th as of recording. Um, basically tomorrow when, um, after we'll have 19 days, well, I'll, I actually don't know what time, on October 27th, so let's just say about 18 days, uh, that is on October 26th, you'll still be able to uh, buy directly from PlayStation 3, Vita stores, uh, with the money you have in there. Otherwise, you're going to have to end up using PlayStation Network ca cards or just loading up into the PlayStation store wallets through the either, like they said, desktop computer, mobile device, PS4, or PS5. But let's finish up the story. So, VGC writes... Continued, excuse me, PlayStation Store gift cards, product vouchers, and subscription vouchers will still work on both PS3 and Vita. Vote, buy digital content for your PS3 console or PS Vita system. You must first add sufficient funds to your wallet on the PlayStation Store, end quote. Sony explained. Yep, basically, just like what I said earlier, PlayStation card. Um, those are mainly the, re the way I've been uh, buying stuff from the PlayStation Network Store. I've never... Uh, use my credit card or debit card or even a PayPal account with uh, PlayStation Network. Um, that was only because uh, I was really young when the infamous PlayStation hack occurred in 2011. Uh, some, of you, some of you guys who were still around playing gaming back then known uh, probably know about the either Team Lizard or Lizard Squad hack that happened that left the PlayStation Network store down for a month. I think it was the entire month of May. Or maybe mistaken, but that's about how long it was down for. It's pretty wild. Uh, let's finish up. As noted by Silicon Era in Japan, purchasing age restricted games on PS3 and Vita will no longer be possible after the update, as buying products with the Cero Z rating on digital platforms requires a credit card to verify the customer's age. In March, Sony announced plans to close the PlayStation Store on PS3, Vita, and PSP this summer. However, following a backlash from players, the company made a partial U-turn in April, saying that it, that it would no longer close the PS3 or Vita stores, but was still planning to shut the PSP store, which it did in July. Alright, so that's basically it. Um, October 27th of this year, the key date, is when the PS3 and Vita stores won't allow you to use your credit or debit cards or PayPal as options to buy things from the stores. Just wanted to let you know, uh, you have about, say if you watch this when this video goes out, then it's gonna be like, like I said, 19, 18 days from now. So, you have until October 27th, fellas. Take care.